Out of the many projects financed by the European Union, some are more effective than others. Choosing the most effective ones is important to give good value for money for the European taxpayers. The EU also oversees regulations that aim to protect its citizens' health and safety and improve the functioning of the single market. But is regulation effective? One way to establish this is using the method of difference in differences, diff in diff, one of the counterfactual impact evaluation methods. Consider some regulation preventing too late payments in commercial transactions. How do we know that the regulation was effective? Assume we have access to data for two groups of firms, where one of the groups, Group A, was exposed to the regulation, while the second one, Group B, was not. Assume also that both groups are observed for two time periods, one and two, one before and one after the introduction of the regulation. Then, consider the difference in average payment days in both groups, between period one and two. Other factors, like growing use of electronic payments, may have affected both changes. We can use Group B as counterfactual, which is what would have happened to Group A without the regulation. The difference between the change in average payment days in Group A and Group B is the diff-in-diff diff estimate of the average effect of the regulation. Rigorous evaluation is useful to find out if regulation works. The diff-in-diff diff provides a powerful method to do so and therefore helps to improve the design of future policies. For more information, visit the JRC website on microeconomic evaluation.